plunder. And you get the white fang. Pretty sure that fang wasn't the color white. I'm pretty sure that was a brown fang, but no complaints here. Wow, do I love these character models. If there's one thing that's amazing, and there's tons of things that's amazing about this game, is that their character models are spot on. I swear, they, they have the best character models in a game I've, I've seen. I don't think even Disney movies can draw them this well. So. And Donald's about to die again. You know what? Me and Donald, Thunder Team and crew, let's go. Here, Donald, run over that, run over that health. Get all this health, Donald. You need it. And there's still more shadows. And I didn't know I was that close to level up again, so let's get Thunder and Thunder. That is working out well. I never really used magic my first couple of times playing this game. I was always more of a run up to them, hit them twice, get hit, and you are back again? I'm not going to care about you anymore. Let's see what happened with uh, Jane. Hey, where's Jane? What's wrong, Tarzan? Yeah, huh? That's the goofy voice. Something coming. Jane, danger. Jane, near. Near Trios. Sounds like trouble. Let's go. No, I wanted to switch. I don't care. I did not want to wait through another black cutscene. And there's more you guys. So thunder, thunder! You're still not dead. And now you're dead. And no, you're not dead anymore. Thunder! Thunder! No. I will not step on your banana peels today. Did you fall on your own banana peel? That's sad. That is sad. You jump into an invisible barrier and then jump onto your own banana peel. Great, great AI game. But I, I can't see this game's too good. And now for the shortcut way, because I already played this game and I know where to go. Please let me fall in the hippo. Very good. So hopefully, I'm gonna, I want to start some uh, Halo 3 with Zim. Do a dual, dual screen commentary of that. That'd be pretty cool, because me and him love that game. We played that game so many times. And we get pretty. He, he he does scream a lot while playing that. Yeah, it's just the thing he does. And I'll let you guys watch this cutscene. That interrupted my story yet again. The big black fruit looks suspicious. What do we do? We do not have anything, so we do not do anything. You hit it once. You don't really need to do that, but you can just hit this thing. Let's go some power wilds. This is the part where I where the power wilds spawn infinitely. That's because it gets you your magic. You need magic to open up those fruit things. And if I get some magic, that would be fine. So we will not be able. Okay. So watch. You lock on. I didn't lock on, but if you use if you use a blizzard right there, you can open open up those fruits, and I'm pretty sure that weekend or something. Like that. But main main goal of this is just to hit the big black nose on the tree. Um, that looks like maybe maybe it's a giant bird coming from the nose. Not that hard. If you want, you could probably just fight Power Wilds there for forever. But mm, only if you're close to level up. Clayton came to the tent, and that's the last thing I remember. Clayton? Gorilla's trapped. Turk ran. 
We must help the gorillas. Yes, this way. We're almost done with this place. We only have one. Whoa, there's a chest right here. What the heck? I know that. That's cool. I miss that every time. Apparently. I will save because I don't have much confidence in me being this for the first time because of the Let's Play Curse. Basically, the Let's Play Curse is anything you're doing live. You can practice this hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of times, but you're just gonna fail on screen. And everyone's watching. And I do not want to cut out that boss fight, but if I do die my first time, I will cut that out. I'll probably, I'll probably go until I get to the end of it. Only if I die, though, I'll cut it out, but other than that, I won't be cutting much stuff out. I'll just be cutting out the rides, the long rides. I, I can't think right now, sorry about that. And you're back yet again. Screw you guys, we're going in here. No, first we're going to party, getting out Donald, because he sucks. Then, we are saving. And then, then, we have some new equipment. So, is the white thing better than any of these? HP is down. That is better. Let us give Goofy Inference Horn. No. Let us give him Inference Horn. No. Let us give Donald Inference Horn, even though Tarzan's probably more important right now, but he still has better stats than Donald. <sighs> abilities, let's see what Tarzan has. No critical plus, that would be nice. Increases odds of dealing critical damage, that would be nice right there. In Donald, I can do charge. That's actually goofy. Anything I can go for Soren? No. Anything Donald? He is still only have one ability. Such a disgrace to our team. I just love how Donald is so weak in the beginning. But once once you get up, his MP goes so far across the screen. He has like he gets like 12 magic bars later, and he's just a threat to be reckoned with because he has all these super strong. Oh my god! He has all these super strong magic attacks. Now forget this, I'm just running right here. There you go! Skipping battles is not like me. Here it is. The Gorillas. I'll let you guys listen to this cutscene, I'll be back after it. Not Clayton. <laughs> Not Clayton. And that was quicker than I thought it was. So basically, this is the first part of the boss fight. Clayton's got his double barrel shotgun. You can own some things up, but you can just own them pretty easily right here. You just gotta take out maybe a fourth, I think, if that, of his HP. Before yet another cutscene gets triggered. And he can cause mental explosions. He said, "What's behind him?" Oh my God, he's got telepathic powers. This is not fair. Now this fight's a lot harder. I recommend staying on the figure that he's riding on because that's a lot more. Uh, I no, actually no. What do I recommend here? I recommend just getting as much damage done. And we can see what it is, he's riding a giant chameleon, that's a heartless. I'm just gonna take out the chameleon. Uh oh. Oh. 
And this is the first time I'm showing off this move. This move is called. Oh, I didn't get the finisher. Get down here. Get thunder! And now we got the chameleon. No, we don't. 